<clears throat> Hello, viewers of the House of Sim channel, and welcome to episode 1 of Empire Overview, in which your host, which is me, Unit Rico, will um, show off empires in uh, grand strategy games that have been um, from the beginning to the end. So, today is the first or actually second, but the first one was uploaded on my own channel. Um, it will be the second um, installment of the series, and the game is European Universalis 3 Divine Wind. In the first one I played through um, the earlier expansion, Heir to the Throne, and uh, let's get right into it. So, here's the map. Concentrated on Arabia, and I don't know why. So, um, here is the beginning map of European Universalis 3 in 1399. So, this is how the world looks like in, well, 1399. So, the nation I played with was Karaman, a small nation on Anatolia that usually gets taken over by the Ottomans. Um, so I kind of wanted to uh, recreate some sort of Ottoman Empire but then with another nation. So I still took the largest one which was indeed Karaman. Um, so I will first uh, show you the options I played with. I believe they haven't changed. Advisor set to normal leaders event, I don't exactly know. You also have historical, but I went with event. Uh, these are all normal colonists, merchant and mer missionaries all cost money. Um, inflation was on, the size of colonists was 400 to kind of stimulate um, faster colonization. Uh, the difficulty and AI aggressiveness set to normal, the spread of land provinces set to normal, the spread of sea provinces set to 25 years, spies also cost money, and lucky nations was set to none. Because otherwise the Ottomans would be uh, probably too tough. And um, so, that's it. Let's um, check out, uh, ignore these. And let's load it. It's loading. And there we go. Yes. As you can see, it's quite a bit bigger. Um, just a bit. So, um, <clears throat> let's fire this up. Oh, and it's set here. I'm allied with Funge, but Funge doesn't exist. So, here's the map, music's back on, we're on the last uh, day even, um, of the, the game, and here is our empire, um, yes, this is pretty much the Ottoman Empire, I believe. The Ottoman Empire may have gone a bit more into Europe at this bit, and uh, this was the Crimea, and they had some vassals here, I believe. But um, this is pretty much it. Um, this is my empire, so let's see. What do we have on the right? We're building a mint, apparently. Well, that's not going to finish. And here are the centers of trade. As you can see, I am dominating trade. Um, I am fully westernized, and um, which means uh, I the my researchers research technologies at the speed the Europeans do. Um, so, if you're not familiar with this game, uh, well, it's pretty much the more you go away from Europe, the slower you research. Yeah, a lot of people are complaining about that. This game is oh, it's all based on Europe. That's why it's called Europa. Here is on this. Anyway, my armies. 
I also dominate in this. I have the largest and most advanced army in the world. <clears throat> it's really, really, really great having that. I can tell you that. Just smashing through everyone. It's kind of fun. Here's the navy. I don't think I have the largest navy because I tend to not bother with it. And here are um, my colonies. Um, Diamantina, which is over here. Yes, this. Um, you might be surprised by this, seeing as it's 1821. These three colonies are the only ones in the world. Except for Africa. In, um, I mean, I have checked uh, the map we were just on, because you can see the entire world. Greenland, which is over here. Uh, it has two uh, colonies usually. It didn't have anything. It was completely empty. I can... The, all of the Americas, except for these three colonies of mine, are empty. I don't know why. It's uh, not entirely unseen. I mean, the Azores and... Well, I don't even... I don't think... No. Madeiras. Madeira has been colonized, so are the Azores, but, um, uh, are these called the Canary Islands, I believe? Haven't been colonized. I, again, I have no idea how, but, alright. Um, so, let's take a look, here. The overview. We are a feudal monarchy. I did that so I got more force limits. Yes, it is by far the best, um type of government, but hey, I'll take it. Our relations are terrible, everyone hates us. Do we care? No, not really. Um, so we are Sunny Muslim. Modifiers. The conquest of... yes, uninteresting stuff really. These are some decisions I made and... Um, you can also find these over here. We have a rather bad reputation. Yes, we do. That's because I went a bit crazy with wars at the end. I think I didn't have all of Greece at... I, I think I had nothing in Greece in... Uh, up until 1800. And then I just conquered it all. Um, oh, by the way, I have installed a mod. Um, which uh, makes the map a bit more simple looking to and the fog of war as well to improve um, uh, the speed of the game as it was running very slowly um, but back here we have our ruler and advisors uh, it's a pretty bad ruler administration skill of five diplomat diplomatic skill of three and a military skill of five we have some advisors here now, the economy. We, I pumped everything into land because I wanted to max out uh, at least one technology, but um, I think 71 is the highest. I think it's that. But I didn't manage to reach it. Oh well. Um, as you can see, each month we're losing 93 uh, ducats. But as we see up here, annually I gain five, almost 600 ducats, so my economy is really good. Now, our military. Um, these are our units. Eastern New Model Infantry, Reformed Lancers, and the Flying Battery. And as you can see, we have 396,000 men under our command, and we can have 421,000. I just never got around. I, I just did I just had didn't know what to do anymore with all these um, I, I just couldn't recruit anymore. I had no actually no place for the armies to be around so I left it at this. Um, the Navy 80 I mean 78 ships which is okay I guess Religious-wise, um, I didn't really bother with religion too much. 
Uh, you can see I had a few um, uh, tolerance. My tolerance is quite high of religion. Um, because I usually don't bother too much with converting. As you can see, religious map mode. This is all Catholic because it used to be of the European.